Connor Murphy, the significance of tonight's meeting? Well, it's the last AGM of Newry and Moon District Council. It's a council formed in 1973, and uh, it will tonight have its youngest ever mayor, Sinn Féin, Mayor Dara Hughes, which we're very excited about. He's a great candidate, a great young councillor. And the fact that we have a mayor here, we will chair the new council when it's set up. Uh, it just shows the strength of the party right across this South Down, South Armagh area. It's reflected right across Ireland. We have mayors now in every major city and town and county across the country. Uh, and it's really a sign of our advance, particularly this year, which has been a very historic election for us, uh, a sign of good things to come, of the party growing and building and getting new and young candidates, put them into positions of leadership uh, and allowing them to find their feet as Sinn Féin elected representatives. That's what's happening here tonight and it's part of a great over overall picture for Sinn Féin uh, and one that we're very proud of. It's a very historic night for Newry Moore District Council, also a very historic night for, for Sinn Féin. Sinn Féin as the Mayor of the outgoing Council, which ceased to exist on the 31st of March. And that's coming on the back of having the Mayor in the last term of Council, Councillor Michael Owen, which will be a hard act to follow as well. And uh, I think Dara will be, I, think I know for a fact he's very articulate, he's very knowledgeable. We uh, as a party uh, as a, are expecting a lot from youngsters like Dara. Uh, people who have progressed up from Ogre Sinn Féin to stand now as the leading citizen in the district in more to the going forward. He will he'll be thoroughly professional, astute, intelligent and articulate. And if it's anything, it shows that our party is in some position now throughout the entire island of Ireland. We're going to have young councillors, both male and female. And we, I mean, that's exciting times. I know I'm coming here at the end of my uh, political life, but uh, it's exciting. And I can see a great future for Sinn Féin over the next five to ten years. Absolutely delighted for Dara Hughes. I mean, I think as a party, it's fantastic to see us involved in so many young people. And I've worked with Dara. I've had the pleasure of working with Dara now on finance committees, you know, um, and different other committees within the party. And he is a particularly efficient, loyal, hard-working, conscientious young man who I have no doubt will represent us and the whole community very, very well. I mean, he's a shining example of young people and I think, you know, Sinn Féin should be very proud of the fact that they are promoting so many young people in these roles because at the end of the day, the party is about the future and we need to be preparing young people and encouraging young people to get involved and the reality of it is, you're going to do that through young people, you know? So, absolutely delighted for Dara. I have no doubt that he'll do a fantastic job for us. A great day for Muri and Morn. He has all of our support and I know he will support all of us. Sinn Féin should be very proud of what they've done in the last 12 months. Hard work still to come, but we're up for it. Cogardis, a big night for yourself, big night for Sinn Féin and Newry Morn. What's your thoughts before you take up office? Oh, you're right, it's, it's a great night for Sinn Féin. It's the second year in a row we've had the mayoralty. I've taken over from uh, Councillor Mickey Ruan, who's had an outstanding 12 months, who's really uh, opened the mayoralty up who's gone to places where, where sitting councillors would never have been before. He's met groups the length and breadth of the district and further afield. And he's really been a credit not only to the district and to the council, but primarily to the party. And a uh, very tough act to follow, but uh, I'll do my best. You know? People keep telling me that I'm very young. I don't feel it after the last eight months of campaigning. But I'm 24, so I'm by a country mile the youngest mayor that Newry Morn's ever had. Uh, I'm one of the youngest, if not the youngest in the north, but I think uh, I was outdone by someone in Dublin. I think I remain nameless. But uh, yeah, the youth, it's one thing. And it's one thing that youth in this district haven't really been engaged with on, on a wider basis. And there's a newly formed youth council, and I've been meeting with them regularly. And I think this will give us a good platform to develop sort of youth development in the area. We have a year left of this council and then it's the last mayoralty and we need to continue the work that we've been doing, the good work that we've been doing to bounce us with good momentum into the new council structures, in, in particular the developments in Steve Gullion and that with, with the representation being thinned, it's going to be harder to fight for our area. But in particular the MOU committee, the Memorandum from, of Understanding, which I sit on between Newry and Morn, uh, Down and Louth, if we continue the good work that we've been doing for the last few years, for the next 12 months, we'll bounce into the new council structures and really uh, work with some cohesion on, on the All-Ireland issues that, that are our priority for us in this area. I'm very aware that Newry and Morn and Louth County Council have had a particularly uh, good relationship over the years. Is that something that you continue with? Oh yeah, it's been fantastic and I've been meeting with uh, uh, Louth uh, elected representatives for months now and, and 
we have a very strong working relationship. And anything, I think that's only going to grow, particularly in, in light of uh, the dubious actions of the opposition or, or the, the cosy consensus of, of uh, conservative politics in Louth Council now that have excluded Sinn Féin from key positions. If anything, that that's an incentive to go in and work harder and deliver on the ground. I think I think the local election results have really set us up for great success across the island, uh, the six counties and the 26 counties. Uh, young people have come through and, and gained mandates in areas that Sinn Féin have never had mandates before and, and young capable representatives that I've proud to be working with and proud to be friends with uh, coming through the ranks through uh, Sinn Féin Republican youth and really stepping up to the plate and taking positions of responsibility. It puts us on a fantastic footing in the, another two years of elections with uh, Assembly, uh, Westminster elections and potential elections in the, to the Dáil as well. I think we're in a fantastic position and we're only getting stronger.